Hey, what's up guys? Jacob here back with another video. This video I'm going to be going over uh, my first impressions of Zeku and I already found a lot with Zeku. I've started, I used him for like an hour now and I found his optimal combo and I just wanted to show you guys uh, the optimal combo. Some combos I found um, and man, I'm just going to go over, you know, how I feel about Zeku and, you know, go over some of his resets that I found and and yeah, just tell you a little bit about um, Zeku. So this is mainly an old man um, Zeku. I haven't like really figured out too much with his uh, regular form. He's a little confusing. Uh, some of his um, cancels are different than in um, old man. Like old man can't cancel his uh, low forward or crouching medium. Neither can he in um, in young. So yeah, there's certain things that are different. But I mainly went over. Um, I mainly know a lot. Are going to go over um, old man uh, Zeku. So, all right, let me go over the max combo first before you know anything else. All right, so that's his max combo. So this move right here is basically down back kick. It's basically a backwards fireball just with kicks, and the other one is fireball with kicks, normal fireball with kicks, and it works that uh, medium links with medium. Heavy links with heavy, and light links with light. You can do uh, medium light, a heavy into medium, but it, it's less damage, so it's not really any um, point of doing that. So yeah, sorry about the sirens in the background. So yeah, <clears throat> you do get a high um, knockup. So his Oki potential off of that is really crazy. If you don't want to just get, you can still get Oki off of this attack, <clears throat> but. Um, it's just that you don't get as much Oki, so that's another thing I wanted to um, show you guys that he gets a lot of Oki off of that, off of his attacks. He's mainly gonna be like really, like strong in the Oki, um, you know, standpoint. Like his Oki is really good, or his his meaty, like his his potential to, you know, he can dash up and uh, pressure you after most of his attacks. So he's really good besides the light version. So. The, the light kick, he can't really dash up. He's zero on dash up after the light. So if you get hit by light, he's zero. So if you have four frame, you still gotta hold that if he, if he, you know, presses the right button. It's not too risky pressing a button, you know, at first, you know, test the waters a little bit. Just to make sure the Zeku actually knows what he's doing, then you're like, okay, he knows, so not to press a button or whatever. So, you know, just take risks. You can take risks, uh... He does decent damage, so it depends on your health. You decide what you want to do. <clears throat> All right. So let me finish talking about the uh, the combo. So, All right, so I'm, I am using the medium version of the um, that version of the kick, the special attack. I am using medium. Medium links with the crouching heavy or heavy. Doesn't matter. You can do heavy or crouching heavy. They both uh, link into the attack. <clears throat> They do the same damage, so you don't have to worry about that. Whichever one you feel comfortable doing, just do it. All right. Thing is, if you back row against Deku, um, you get more um, Oki. I know I'm going over his Oki so much, but it is so cool that, you know, it, it's so fun to use right now. So, my bad, I get a little bit of sidetrack. He's just really fun right now, so sorry. <coughs> All right. So the thing about this right here is that you can extend it if you want to. You have to spend meter though, if you want to extend it. I don't think it's that um, useful though because um, I don't know. It's not useful to me because <laughs> you're spending two bars just to get a little bit more damage. So his normal optimal does 311 or 30 damage basically, but the 30% um, damage. But if you extend it. He barely does, does 40. So, spending two bars, you'd rather just save it to, to go into super. His super is pretty good anti -air, and he doesn't have the best anti -air. His only good anti is here, so... Saving your super for when someone jumps in on you is very good, because his super is almost like a flash kick. So you can really use this to stop people from jumping in on you. So building super is very useful. It, his anti-airs are okay. So that's that's why I say that. 
Alright. Nothing wanna go over us after since I went over the combos is his reset. So I don't have any chicken resets yet for him. The only thing I gotta tell you guys is that um mainly his um cross up from the um, this attack right here. So this attack is basically fireball. You guys figured it out it's fireball. <clears throat> and depending on the how low you get it, the more plus it is. So the kick is more plus than the um the cross up. I figured that because even um, I usually get pretty high on the kick and still able to link medium kick but even if I get it like a little high on um, this I still can not link the uh, you know the medium like the um, the kick can version of the cancel you can feel it it's, a, it's just a little slower like the the recovery frame you can feel it so going for the crosser you mainly just want to go for a jab confirm Cause you don't want to be getting really low you get jabbed out for trying to go that low inkling super it's a little you know it's a little hard but over time you get used to it so yeah he has good options it's just timing it. It's a little different. A little hard. Yeah. Just timing, getting down timing, and knowing. It, it takes a little bit of experience to know, you know, where you have to be placed and stuff. So he's definitely someone that you have to be playing with a lot. If you really want to get into Zeku, play him right now, and you know, you know, play him as much, you know, because he's not um. He's really in depth, so if you're really gonna commit to his character, then you're gonna have to commit. You can't just uh, play him a little bit and expect to do really good with him. He's not that type of character. He doesn't have throw loops, so it's not you know nothing crazy. So yeah, you don't have to worry too much about that. All right. All right. So nothing I want to go over some. Some weird, I mean, it's not really like it's not gonna be used too much, <laughs> obviously, but it's something he has. So, if you go into his uh back, um, it's just weird. If you go into his um, his back, whatever this is, it's basically a uh, guy's old move, it's like a shoulder brush or whatever. You can kind of flip the other side, depending you know, certain things that you do. So I don't know too much about uh, young um, Zeku, so you guys might know more just right now about Zeku at this time, about young Zeku. So you know, I haven't gone too much over him, so don't rag me about it too much right now. That's one thing I found, you could do like a cool cross up with him to get him back into the corner. It's, it's okay, it's nothing crazy, but I guess it's something, I guess, it's a little cool. So if you do his shoulder twice, his light shoulder, when he's in the corner, you'll be able to cross up. Nothing crazy, but I guess it's 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 cool. But another thing I want to go over is his crush counter. Um, Zeku's crush counter is crouch fierce and uh, heavy kick are his crush counter attacks. So yeah. You can dash up and uh, finish the combo after. Like remember that the uh, the light one is zero on dash up. If someone back rolls it, you get a little more oaky. So I'm not sure exactly what you can do right now, but you could probably you could do something maybe, but it's a little risky. Yeah, you can dash up. Okay. You can get two, so you get enough time. I'm not sure if you can um. I tried medium kick and it never worked. Once I get like the frame data for him, then I'll figure out more stuff. And it'll be a lot easier to, you know, to tell you guys about this stuff. So yeah, for now it's more impressions just showing you what I found so far. You know, max combo and some tactics with um, Zeku. So he has a lot of Oki, so... Make sure you're taking that to advantage. Especially after this, look how much Oki you can get if he wants to. 
If he really wants to, he can reset you like crazy. If you're able to meteor, your, uh, you know, that flip, you can do some cheeky stuff with it. I'm pretty sure. It's all about just being creative and just being very well with timing. It's not as active though with that this attack right here. So you might get jabbed out a lot. Fortunately, it's not that active. Has Akuma's heavy punch, so and it's a little, a little shady. Zeko overall, I think he's pretty good though. I don't think he's gonna be a bad character. I don't think he's gonna be that good though. Seeing what the uh, the really good characters have in this game, I don't think the um, they're gonna be really good. He's gonna be that good to to stop people from you know with the throw loops and stuff like that. He doesn't have a throw loop or anything crazy. He doesn't have anything too cheeky. He has some stuff, but it's not like uh, cheeky. It's just very good OP. So yeah, that's kind of it that I figured out. Um, I got the maximum combo. Um, I, I showed you guys some combos. Haven't gone through everything with young Zeku, so don't rag me about that. Needed the V trigger too, so I'm going to be making a part two when I figure out more stuff and I go more in depth into it. So this is more of a first impression video and just you know some tactics I figured out and combos. So and I hope you guys enjoyed. You know, appreciate this and. Yeah, let me let me know how you guys feel about Zeku in the comments. I really want to know. You know, I think he's gonna be probably mid tier. Uh, if you want, just uh, let me know what you think. You know, what tier he's gonna be put in, or how you feel about him. You think he's good? You think he's broke? You know, and if you agree that he has good, um, you know, Oki, then yep. Yeah. Huh? I wonder what you could do here. Oh. See if I could. Uh, it kind of just give him more of a juggle. Yeah, still does the same thing though. So, yeah, that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys uh, appreciate it. And that I am out. Goodbye.